All right, welcome back to the month of 2600. It's time for the Earth dies screaming. <laughs> I could just see that the globe just going. Ah, fuck! Yeah, that'd be cool. That would probably be cooler than this game, actually. I'm not saying it's a bad game, but I'm not saying it's a good game either. Let's begin. Okay, you control, you go back and forth, side to side. All right. The cursor is what you're shooting, and up here's the radar indicating where the bad guys are. Ah, I just got hit, but that's okay because so far, I can't figure out how to die. Now when you've got one in your target range, let's get one in range here. Your cursor will dance around the screen and target in on it. And I'm going to keep hitting them and keep taking hits and I'm not going to figure out how to die. What's really cool though is the digit counters actually do that rolling animation. So that's pretty cool. It's like an old school EM pinball machine. Boom! I think the premise here is like you're supposed to be defending the earth while it dies screaming or some shit. But... I can't really recommend this game. I mean, I'm not gonna say it's a stink bomb and this is not a shitty Sunday feature. Even though I do need to do one of those yet. You know what? Because it's actually playable. But the thing is, it's really fucking boring. I mean, I don't even want to play anymore, so... Yeah, take that as you will. I don't want to play any more of this. I have no idea what that beeping is about. And it doesn't seem like there's an end to the level, either. They just keep coming in and coming in and coming in. I played for a good 20 minutes before I did this review of mine. Oh, they seem to be almost going down to the earth now. Boom. But yeah, anywho, not a game I recommend. Sorry. Let's do a collecting 20th Century Fox and we're looking for a cool label. So I'm not going to talk about an alternate today because I don't even recommend this game. Tomorrow's Activision Day. Hopefully we'll be playing something better. See you tomorrow.